Okay, we're here with our 106th Nebraska Amateur Champion, David Klaus, a friend. Uh, David, first of all, let's talk about today. Uh, you really had it going out there. You're just in the zone today? You know, I was. I've been, I've been practicing well and playing pretty well for the last two years and haven't been able to put together a win yet. And uh, things really came together this week. Um, I had to try really hard to stay in the present tense today because my... My normal mind uh, likes to wander ahead a little bit and gets me in trouble when I do that. So I worked really hard on that coming into this tournament to, to practice that and, and do that, and I was successful in doing that today. Uh, 66 today is the round of the championship. Uh, did you, I mean, were you thinking about a number at all coming today? I, I really thought I uh, wanted to shoot 68. I thought if I could do that, uh, the guys that were behind me were going to have to really play exceptionally well to catch me. But then when I got out here and I saw how hard the wind was blowing, I thought, oh my gosh, uh, that's going to be uh, pretty hard to do. So uh, I just played every shot the best that I could, and, and I really, to be honest with you, I didn't know how many under par I was or where I was at. Yeah, um, kind of got off to that uh, hot start in the front nine, I mean, two chip-ins. Uh, what were those like for you? Well, again, you know, you just try to play the shot that's in front of you and try to do the best that you can. I know six, uh, I had a really tough third shot coming into the green there, and uh, I was on a pretty pretty hard slope, and I, I didn't hit it quite as hard as I wanted to, and I was able to roll one in from a little bit off the green there. Uh, that felt pretty good, and then I, I don't know how my golf ball got where it got to on the, on the par three. I thought it was in the middle of the green, and I got up there, and it was back there about 10 feet away, and I was able to make that. So... Uh, making those two birdies really, really helped me a lot. Gave me a lot of confidence that I could uh, continue to play well and, and uh, finish the thing off. All right. Uh, on that back nine, um, you know, you kind of just kept gaining shots on the field. And um, was there ever a moment when you knew you had it? When I pulled my ball out of the cup on 18. <laughs> I never looked at any scoreboards all day. I, I didn't want to know anything. I just wanted to keep playing and stay focused on what I needed to do for each shot. Um, you won in 99, and uh, I know you had some back issues. Uh, I mean, what does this mean to you to come back from all that and uh, win something like this? Well, it's, it's an absolute dream come true. Um, you know, when I, I, I played awful well in 1999, I think I won six major tournaments that year and was awarded player of the year and uh, was ready to continue that type of play. And then uh, the next year I went down uh, with an injury and eventually I had surgery on it in 2004 and it took several years after that to try to heal up from that and and then you know the difference between being able to go out and play golf and play uh, championship golf is a, is quite a step and it takes a lot of practice and a lot of a lot of work to, to try to get back to that level all right congratulations all right thank you